Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode nine and the Merseyside derby. Hopefully it'll be a bit more exciting than the real one that just happened. We've had to do a little bit of chopping and changing. We've still got Macca's out injured for a little bit. Macca's still suspended. Uh, Steve Harkness is out on loan, so he shouldn't even be in the first team squad. Um, David Thompson's got a bit of a knockage, so he's going to go off. So we've got um, no right midfielder. So Michael Thomas is, is fine. His crossing is not ideal. I could make it. Do I make him a playmate? No. We could make him a wide midfielder. That's a bit more his style. And send Gerard up there. Gerard has he's just a machine. He's recovered despite playing 120 minutes as a 15-year-old. I might actually break him if I play him too much. John Scales and uh, Rob Jones are back in. Uh, Dominic Mateo's coming in back in at left back. I promise Stig more game time, but I've played him he's had five starts and two sub appearances. As a backup, you'd think he'd be pleased with that. So I'm hoping he'll just Stop being a whiny little bitch. Got Digger back in on the left-hand side. We've got Robbie Fowler and Ian Rush. Ian Rush needs to get goals. Because Owens, like, he scored a bunch of goals early on and has not done as well since. Stan Collymore, well, he's just Stan Collymore. Um, yeah, anything else I want to do? I was tempted to go Jamie Carragher again. He had a good, decent game out last time. But we're going with the more experienced. David James is obviously back in goal. And uh, we'll go from there. Good luck, everyone. Let's have a look at those blue nose bastards, then, shall we? Uh, they've got Amakachi up front. Daniel, who's fruity. Um, target man, big donkey Ferguson. Everton legend, 20 strength, 20 jumping reach, 20 aggression, 20 bravery, 20 heading. <laughs> it's like, oh, what a target man that is. My scouts don't really even rate him. Yeah, the fans' contempt towards the player <laughs> might have to, have to be taken into account. Yeah, he likes ascending off. He's got injury. He's slow. He's one-footed. And he's he's slow off the mark and slow. He's throwing it in the end. No shit, Sherlock. Anders Limpard. <laughs> Some of these names. It's so good. It's so good. It's almost like flashbacks to when you used to collect the Panini sticker albums. And you go, oh, Anders Limpard. I'll take it. David Unsworth. Very nice. We've got Vinny, I believe. Yeah, Vinny Samways, who's all right. Nothing too special. Andre Cancelsi, I loved him. He was a Ch uh, Man United, wasn't he? Despite being a Man United player. Um, really liked Cancelsi. Andy Hinchcliffe, who's good. They're all fucking good, aren't they? We've got Dave. Big Dave Watson. Is he Big Dave? He's six foot. He's average sized what Dave what Dave average sized Watson. Chris Short, who's ironically not short. Who's really not pacey either. And he looks like he's just sniffed his own fart. Um we've got Mark Hotting Hottinger. 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 That sound, sounds vaguely familiar. And big Neville Southall. Legend of a goalkeeper. 96 caps for Wales. Right. But we've definitely got the better team. We just need to get Ian Rush performing. All right. Which I'd never thought I'd have to say. It's fucking Ian Rush. He's getting on a bit, but his tributes are still there. Just needs to go just needs a goal. The trouble is he all my strikers other than Stan Collymore are are either poachers or advanced forwards. And I don't like playing two advanced forwards or a or a poacher advanced forward combo. So somebody has to drop a little deeper, and unfortunately it is Mr. Mr. Ian Rush. Oh, wow. This is... It actually might be as boring as the Merseyside derby the other day. I wonder if Ch if Everton all misses many chances. Oh, look, Duncan Ferguson. He's got no face. Oh, I thought that was his head. Duncan Ferguson has just got a header. Shock news, everyone. <sighs> It's always gonna. It's always gonna be hard stopping Duncan Ferguson getting on the end of crosses. Come on, boys! We've got decent possession. I think we'll be we'll be all right. Yeah, we are in control of this match. Keeping possession of the ball, and we're not getting the shots on target. Right, good header from Jones. Why is my game stuttering? Red nap. Not injured yet. Good stuff, Thomas. This is where we're a bit weak on this right-hand side for this game. It's a lovely spread ball to Barnsley. Cuts inside. Fowler. Looking for Rush. Rush, lovely header back, and it's an easy catch for Big Nev. <clears throat> Why 
is my game stuttering? How can you so badly program a game that looks like it's from 1993 and yet struggles on a decent computer? Oh, David James, I think he saved it with his face, but they all count. Oh, dangerous, dangerous, boys. Danger, danger. Yes, Johnny Barnes getting it away. Anders Limpar, Kanchelskis, Fowler. Don't want to give away free kicks there, boys. Don't like it. I don't like it. Everybody just mark Duncan Ferguson. All just crowd him. Like, get hands, group hands around him. All right, Hinchcliffe. Where's Dunk? Is, there he, is that in there? There he is. Good tackle, Barnes. And we break. Really, really slowly. Okay, we don't break. All right. Hmm. Oh, dear, oh, dear. What is that defending? Nothing changes. We still can't defend the set of pieces. That's a free volley. He had all the time in the world. He probably could have taken a couple of touches. Look, he could have as well. Could have had a sandwich and a cup of tea and then shot. Oh dear, we're going to lose the Merseyside derby. That's not that's not a good way of endearing yourselves with the fans, is it? You're much better than this, you slags. Bob Jones is looking nervous. Oh, fuck off, he's so experienced. Why would he be nervous about this shit? Okay. Whole of the defence is playing like a turd sandwich. Right, Babs coming in for Ruddock. Bit more legs. Barnsley's going to play up there. Um, just go on wing your attack. Just support Rushy. Overlap. And we're coming out attacking. Oh, fucking hell. We can't lose this, boys. Mm-mm. I don't know why the game is stuttering. Oh, <laughs> in the least shocking news of the century, Jamie Redknapp's injured. Ah, you're fit. You'll do, mate. You'll do. Um, okay. Fuck. Right. I think when's McAteer back? Another game? Maybe next game? What we've done nothing. It's, this is supposed to be the big one, boys. What we felt? I'm bringing on the youngster. I'm tempted to bring on Stan Collymore, you know. Just he gives us something a bit different. Right, we need to win this. Win this header. No, of course not. It's Duncan Ferguson. Flicks it on. Amakachi hits the post. We scramble it away. Oh, this is... Bad. No, not opposition, Mark. I don't want opposition shit. Right? I want that. Pump it. Pump it. Stop being more expressive. You shit at it, clearly. Um, get stuck in. Should have get, it's a Merseyside derby. I should have had get stuck in for the first minute. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, I might have a bit of talking to do after this game, boys, to the old uh, press conference. I don't know how I'm going to spin this one. Just been boshed 2 0. <coughs> Pretty even game they just created. I can't click. Duncan Ferguson's the difference maker. Fucking hell. That's not good. We need this Champions League win, and that's really bad. Three weeks. Standard. Mecca's out for 11 days. Thompson's suspended for the next match. Oh, and he's got a pull going anyway. That's fine. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Right, next <clears throat> next game, boys. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. 
So I just asked the board, because, you know, we've got £45 million in the bank. So I just asked for the board for, you know, we're making money each month. Asked them for some money, because, you know, we haven't spent anything this season. And they told me to fuck off. So, <sighs> not ideal, lads. I was hoping, just give us £10 million, I could get a cut of fruity, just squad depth. And a goalkeeper. That's all I need. A bit of squad depth. Maybe another striker. Maybe a backup left winger and a right winger. Also, maybe a centre-back. But, you know, that's all I need. All right? I sound like Jose Mourinho. I've not enough money to spend. <laughs> right, okay. Three players called up. Okay, good stuff. Fitness tests. Right. Forget the last game. It was one of those random, weird games. <sighs> it should be fine. Mac is not quite back from injury, but Jason McAteer is not banned for this game. It could be. I think he's back, or it's a European thing. Um, might as well stick a goalkeeper on the bench. Go on then. For all you people that always tell me off for not having a goalkeeper on the bench, I'll treat you to a goalkeeper on the bench. Okay. <clears throat> Rush is awful. Why is Rush playing so bad? Right. Okay, if Stan Collymore scores, I will remove him from the transfer list. Okay? This is my solemn promise. Um, just trying to think. I'm trying to think. I don't like this right hand side. Trying to think of something we could do here. Can one of my strikers should be able to play on this wing? Maybe he's an inside forward. Rushy, right? You've been shit everywhere else. Why don't you try this, son? All right. Okay. It looks a bit weird, right? But it's going to be fine. What does Jason McAteer prefer being? It's not really that useful that, mate. We could... McAteer could play as a winger, but we also lack central midfielders, so let's not worry about that. Right, Rushy. Maybe I've, I've, maybe I've found the position. He's doing a Wayne Rooney. As he gets older, just slowly working his way down the field. He'll it, By the end of the season, he'll be playing in goal. Okay. We've looked at this team relatively recently anyway, so I won't bother showing you too much detail there. Pedro Martins is there. Whatever that star means. I don't know why it doesn't tell you what the star... That, he's got goals, doesn't it? He's, our, he's their top goal scorer. I think that... No, he hasn't scored a goal. Okay, what does that mean? He's their top goal scorer. <coughs> Fucking stupid icons. Right, do this for the fans. This, this win will get us close to the knockout stages. <clears throat> We're going to have to keep an eye on Rush. See what magic he can produce. Looked like a bit of a stamp for McAteer, but he's got away with it. Collymore. Fowler to Rush. Go on, Rushy. That's decent. That's decent. That's decent. Collymore! He almost stayed at Liverpool with that goal, my friend. Gerard, Ball across. Easy defence. Stan's going to get there, though. Stan the man. Go on, Gerard. Battle. Battle. That's assault on a child. He's 15 years old. You dirty bastards. Okay. Bright start, boys. Bright start. Gerard's there. He's headed away. Barnsley. Come on. Ping one in, Digger. Fowler. Gerard. Go on. Oh, you see Gerard at that position and you get a, get a semi on. Oh, just ping it back in, Barnes. Don't let it go out for a throw. What's, what a waste. Okay, it's a good, bright start, boys. Nuruddin Nabet. Nuruddin Nabet. We must close Amanike down. He he can really cross them all. Okay. We're not struggling. How are we struggling to cope? I want. We've got more possession. Oh, we did it. Okay, we did have more possession. Fucking, but they barely had a shot. Ian Rush is being played out of position. Thank you. These are so good. This tactical advice, always ignore. So good. 
and I mean that in the most ironic way possible. I like to know, does anyone actually use these? I normally go into it and just change, just remove them all. Okay, Real Madrid are 2-0 up. Is that good? They're top of the group. Yeah, that's good. That's good. But we need... They've got an injury. Nice. Connie Moore. Drifted to this left-hand side like a shit Thierry Henry. Scales. Gerard. Nice. Take it. Rushy. Now. Nice. Just lays it off. Keeps it simple. Connie Moore. Lovely. Fowler. Yes, I'm getting there, Fowls. Go on, Robbie. Snort the line. Snort the line. No, he's gone... Just whenever it sort of vibrated next to the fans. Nice. Nice rush. Keeping it simple. He laid it off. Made the run. Right foot as well, Fowler. God himself has scored another goal. Oh, shit. That was their goalkeeper. <laughs> Who's that? Is that their backup goalkeeper? It's not great, is he? <clears throat> Oh my god, 70, this game's gone quick. Oh, why is that? Why are you looking nervous, boys? Um, Thomas for Gerard. Don't need a sending off. I reckon we can just see this game out. So I'm not too bothered about scoring another goal. Just going to keep players rested. Concentrate. Right, Fowler. Oh my word! That's, that's unnecessary, mate, wasn't it? <laughs> Oh, that was an amazing, proper two-footed lunge there, son. Right. Thomas. Kennedy. Collymore. Needs his goal. Oh, that's just nothing. That's just, you, got, you got tackled by an injured bloke. Right, winners. Oh, don't. Don't. We've got five men back here. Oh, my word. That's optimistic, isn't it? Just chill. Yeah, we should have... This game should be far beyond down by now. So let's not go silly. All right, Kennedy. Okay, he's won it back. Stan Collymore. Can he get another assist? Fowler's there. Unlucky. It's decent. It's better. It's better. All right, I'm nervous. I don't... I feel like something horrible is going to go wrong. Okay, just end it. Look at all the shots we're having. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I don't know how we've only scored one goal, but I think we can say we deserve this result. Colin Moore's drifting there to the left-hand side again. That's fine. I don't mind that. That's it. Just keep him pen back. Keep him pen back. That's it. Oh. Oh, there's still time. Oh, Jason McAteer. What a tackle that was, son. Take a bow. Right. Oh, my God, Kennedy. He just runs into him. He just doesn't even try and... Beat anyone. He just runs into people. Hoping for a, what, a lucky bounce, I guess. <sighs> I'm going to say, yeah, I'm, I agree. Disappointing. Disappointing. But we got the win. Oh, God. Um, Stan Collymore. Hmm. Hmm. So it's just you two, is it? Just you two. Okay, well, Stan, I think you've... Uh, that's the final nail in the coffin, isn't it, Stan? Um, Cull. I do it as I see fit and believe them to have been entirely appropriate. Yeah. So it's just Stan Collymore, is it? Is it because I've put you on the transfer list, Stan? I'm going to ignore the fact Stan's pissed off and never play him again. All right. You were just starting to... Sneak into the team a little bit there, buddy. And now you just destroyed any chance of that. Who'd thought Stan Collymore being a bit of a dick? Can't believe it. It's so un out of character for him. Right, there we go, my friends. Not the best of episodes. Lost the derby, but we got a win in the Champions League. And it's now looking pretty damn good, to be honest. We're four points clear. Just need to draw... I don't do maths. That would give us eight if they won six. No. We need stuff still. But it's looking good. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. And let's all hope somebody buys Stan Collymore.
Do Benfica have money? Do, do they have 20 million? It's, it's unlikely. Thank you very much. See you in the next one. Oh, hang on. <laughs> he lords Rush's versatility. Uh, no. Just fuck off, Stan. Bye-bye. Oh, hang on. Fuck's sake. Um, delegating... <laughs> In the light of Stan comments, comments regarding your recent team talk, are you considering delegating that responsibility to a more inspiration? No, he's wrong. Why can't I say he's wrong? That makes no sense. It's like I almost have to agree with him. We continue operating the same manner as usual. Nothing will change. Dickhead. Bye-bye.